Deva, Shri Ganesha, Deva, Shri Ganesha, Deva, Shri Ganesha, Deva, Shri Ganesha. Hey, welcome back to our stupid reacts. Did it? I'm Corbin. I'm Rick. And follow us on Instagram. It's so juicy. Suck a try. Wait, think what to do. Think what to do. Patreon. Follow us. Twitter account. Ring bell. Follow us on the Squaw. Whoa. Follow us on my own personal YouTube channel. Yeah. Like Hooligan. Yeah. For, uh, for uh, juice content. Uh, eat, eat, yeah. Go, go, go. There's, there's so much. You're not getting the full juice if you ain't following us on social media, man. There's good stuff that the stupid family does. They put my face on women's bodies. Like gross. Uh, anyway, today. They do. Is um, Ganesh mm -hmm. uh, Chatu. It's an 11 day. Chut three. Is that how you pronounce that? Chat three. I don't want to mispronounce that. <laughs> Did, well, we know it's Ganesh. Yes, I know Ganesh. And I believe it's Chaturthi. 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 Uh, and yeah, I, festival I, I think it was last year. It could have been just, uh, just last year in general, just not on the date. But that song with Rithik from Agnapath, I believe it is. Which the, has been on my playlist ever since. And uh, every workout that I do, that song is in my head. Ganesh, oh, man. Day of Ash. Can you watch that movie? <sighs> Could that be the next Rithik movie you watch? We're overdue for a horrific We're overdue movie. for a lot of people. It's yeah, hard. I know. Anyways. And everybody else in other places is yeah. saying, yeah? Anyways, uh, so happy uh, Ganesh Chathuri, if that's what you're supposed to say. Chathuri. Close enough. On this day, uh, for all of you celebrating. Yes. Let's do it social distance wise. Be safe. Be uh, but this is a song, uh, it's a Marathi song. Um, Sur Naragas Ho. Ho. With uh, Katyar Kaijet Gusli. Shankar Mahadevan, which yeah, we this, know, yeah, from Breathless, Anandi Joshi. And then this is, I think, a... Uh, Ganesh Chaturthi is a festival celebrating the arrival of Ganesh to Earth from Kailash Parvat with his mother goddess Parvati. The festival is marked with the installation of Ganesh clay idols privately in homes or publicly on elaborate pandals. Lord Ganesh is the symbol of wisdom, prosperity, and good fortune. And I do believe it's an 11 day mm. festival. It's because we've actually gone, a, obviously, a full year yeah. And reacting to different festivals. Correct. So now we're coming up again on all these festivals that we react to with different songs. Yes. So this was subbed by our beautiful subbers. Thank you, sub subbers. So you know the subs are going to be you subpar. Know the subs are gonna be... Not, I'm kidding. They're going to yeah, be amazing. Gonna say, they're going to be beyond subpar. They're going to be on par. They're going to be better than. They're going to be great. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Yeah. 
costuming mm -hmm. uh that what is that the pattern on the ground beneath them which is a, a, a we've seen it done at so many different festivals i think they do it at a lot of because they, they do, do it, it all the time league. with the floor painting with the the colors that they put and they sprinkle in the yeah. patterns mm -hmm. it looks that was a big one underneath them but i don't know it was the powdered because it would have been run all over the place but yeah. it was cool to recognize that i think they do that pattern in a lot of festivals just like they use color in a lot of right. festivals exactly um but yeah, it was really pretty. I'm pretty sure that was actually Shankar Mahavadan, that main guy singing. That yeah, was like that was there. Him. Right, that's what I thought. Um, because we've seen him in a few of the, his other videos. I didn't know he acted that much. Maybe he doesn't, maybe he just came in for the song. Because I know he's like a, a famous singer and a famous right. playback singer. I thought he was mostly and only known as a playback singer. Yeah, because cool, he did that Breathless right. uh, song. Uh, and, and other other things that we saw after that. That was our first exposure was Breathless. Breathless, and then we've obviously seen him from a lot of his films uh, that he sings in, but he's been in a lot of the videos though. So like, right, that are in the film. So I don't know, maybe he acts or maybe he just comes in and he sings. Maybe I can see, I can hear Stupid Babies saying, we've sent you so many links to so many things that he's done. There's a lot of you guys. <laughs> And I love every time it goes to dissonant notes, which are the notes that you don't expect to hear based on dissonant. The key, yeah, the key, the key of a song. And obviously, Eastern is very different from Western, but there's still what you refer to as a dissonant note. It's an in-between note that typically you only go to and come out of unless you're being really cool. And I love any kind of song that does that. Especially they went to it over and over again, and at the end there, they went to it again. That. They built the core around it and it's kind of resonating and you want it to resolve. Oh, they, oh. Did, they did it way better than you did. Way better than I did. <laughs> but it's just such a cool thing. It's very difficult to pull off too harmonically when you sing because you have to find the note without the underlying music giving you the note. Mm -hmm. it, it's, it's an in-between note that if you listen for it, you're not going to find it. Because that's like a trick to singing is to find, you can hear the note either in the chord or the chord that's about to come. But if it's a dissonant note that's outside the, the, the realm of like the major, because that was in a major key uh, most of the time, you, you can't find that note. So it's hard and it sounds cool. Yeah, yeah. totally. You're bored spit. Was, <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> Sorry, I got all music nerdy. Uh, well, I'm sure the people that knew what you were talking about, they really enjoyed that. Um, <laughs> the rest of them turned it off. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I like art. That's that's great. That's why you're here. <laughs> because if not, it's just I like his mustache. I thought his that's mustache true. was really cool. That guy's got a great mustache. That song sounded groovy, man. 
I liked what he did there with the rhythms. And his mustache. Yeah, and when he sang, did you see what happened to his mustache? Anyways, it was a, ah. it was a really pretty song, all jokes aside. Um, this film was based on a play by the same name, released in 1967. Uh, protagonists were played by Mohesh Kale. Really? What? The play was revived in 2010, and the pro protagonist was played by Mohesh Kale. I didn't know Mohesh. We've seen him multiple. We've seen multiple of him singing. Um, he's a classical singer. I remember his name. I can't place his face when you uh, say his name. But he's I like absolutely classical. know that name. I didn't know. Yeah. It looks like it was a play. Um, so I guess that makes sense if he was singing in a play. But I, I had no idea that he acted at all. I, that's surprising to me. Anyways, but you know, I don't know anything. That's something I'd really like to find out about is Indian theater. Yeah. Like original Indian plays. I know there's Bengali plays for mm -hmm. sure that were written for Bengali theater. It still seems like though it's and very, still are. heavily influenced by Shakespeare. Because we've talked to a bunch of people. Yeah. And they all quote Shakespeare as the, it's hard to get away from. He is. Um, for a million reasons. Yeah, I'm not saying yeah. he was the originator. I'm sure that would no, no, much. no. But I mean, he's. It's hard for him not to influence when. Yeah, but I. I wonder. Are there like, for example, I'm very familiar mostly with Bengali culture for a million reasons. Why, obviously? Oh. And the, uh, I would love to know, just theater wise, how much is done on stage and written specifically. For all we know, that's happening in all the regions just like film is. I can't wait to see Monroe in his one man play. Oh, please. One day. That'll be great. <sighs> he's coming, wanna, he's I, coming to Broadway. I want to work with that man. You yeah. know how much fun it would be and rewarding it would be to, to, to work with that guy on Why? a show? Is he good? <sighs> <laughs> well, happy uh, Ganesh. <sighs> Hold on. Chorotri. Chorotri. Chaturthi. Ganesh. Ganesh Chaturthi. To you, to Torfi. Celebrate and stay safe. Yes.